Hi everyone, today we're learning to find the mean of a set of numbers. Now, the mean is just another way of saying the average. So it's not the best, it's not the worst, it's just the average. Now, where might you find or use the mean in the real world? Well, quite often mean is used in sports. Um, cricket players uh, often talk about how many runs they would score on average. Um, and basketball players um, quite often have the average number of points or rebounds or steals that they would make per game. Uh, you can sometimes use the average uh, when you're talking about yourself or your class, so maybe you might have the average height of people in your class, or maybe even the average shoe size of, um, of people in your class. And very commonly, the mean or average is used um, when talking about time. So if you walk to school or you get dropped off in the car, um, you'll know about the average time, the, you know, the approximate time it takes you to get to school every day, so you know what time to leave in the morning. So, next question is, how do you find the mean or the average? Well, all you need to do is add up all the numbers um, of the set of numbers that you have. And, <clears throat> excuse me, in math term, this is called finding the sum. And then you just divide by the number of numbers. So, let's have a look at an example. Here are some people. Uh, we've got um, four set of numbers in our data set. And this is the, um, the length of time it takes people to get ready in the morning to do their hair. So it takes one person um, three minutes, takes another person four minutes, takes another person ten minutes, and takes another person three minutes. So we're going to find out the average time. So the first thing we need to do is add all the numbers together. So we add three plus four plus ten plus three, and we get twenty. And then what we need to do is divide by the number of numbers. So if we have a look at our, our data set, there's one two, three, four numbers in our data set. So we take our total, 20, and we divide it by the number of numbers, which is four. And then basic facts, 20 divided by four, we can find the average or the mean is equal to five. And that's how you do it. Check out another video for some more examples.